Hello, ma'am. Hi. You said, ma'am, you're off for t t 20 days or two months and your husband doesn't ask you for that. He doesn't bother. So how do you take it? You said, I have an understanding. I, I, did, I, I hope you didn't mean he doesn't bother with you. <laughs> <laughs> Whether you are gone. <laughs> My husband bothers, actually cares for me. <laughs> it is not, how, do you, how do you differentiate between that he is an understanding husband and he lets me do what I want to do or he is no more emotionally attached to me? My God, <laughs> is it? <laughs> I know my husband for the last 45 years, four years before my marriage, 41 years after marriage. So I know what he is. He's not, he doesn't bother, I never said that. He bothers, that's it, then he makes it compulsory when I'm out. He says, I have to take a security with me because I go to sometimes in an area where it's hard to go. I have to call once a day, I have to carry my water, he takes care of that. But he understands my passion for my work. He says, if, you are in, if there is um, funny in Bhuneshwar and I'm sitting in Bangalore, then he says, my heart is in Bhuneshwar, my mind is in Bhuneshwar, I'm physically in Bangalore. He says, that is not correct. You should allow, I mean, that's the way I interpreted his way. He believes every flower should bloom with its own pace, its own wish. Not somebody should control it. And so, thing, so the same thing I have done that for him. When Murthy travels six months in a year, you know, I understand his busy meetings. It's very important in marriage, you should understand each other than any gifts. Okay, you may not give birthday gift, you don't even remember each other's birthday. You know, daughters tell us, ma'am, uh, amma, it's your wedding anniversary, otherwise Mr. Murthy will not even know. It is not bothering. The care is the passion. The passion, without that you don't survive. Or without that passion, you are not happy. And he allows me, or he supports me in my passion. And it's the greatest... Uh, um, you know, it's the greatest quality I, I feel. When I go for two months, he's really worried about me. Because in case I get jaundice, I go to an area known as Bhavani Patana uh, in uh, uh, Orissa, uh, you know, 14 hours from Bhuneshwar. You have to take a train, then you have to take a jeep, then you have to take a boat, and then you have to walk. And then you have a jump, uh, jumping jaundice there. He's worried about me that how will I survive? I mean, in case something happens to me. But he understands also that without that, I'll be unhappy. And that is the reason. A person who is not emotionally attached will not even bother where you are. But a person who is emotionally attached and who cares for you, always is concerned about what you like. And that, I feel, is most important for all girls. It is not the rich husband. It is not the powerful husband. It is not the position. It is the understanding man you should marry. More than that, you know, otherwise you won't be happy in life. <laughs>